Welcome to the Windows Computer and Technology channel, and apparently this tip works, and it will actually accelerate the speed at which your Windows updates install. I suspect that, of course, a lot of you, when you install Windows updates, keep the settings page open with the updates downloading and installing on the PC. And often it's probably to view where it's at and what it's doing and, and so on. Well, a uh, Twitter user uh, called Albacore has mentioned that closing the settings page while the updates are downloading and then installing on your PC actually makes installing the updates faster. So I have not tested this, but um, it's kind of interesting. I saw an article on Neowin where they installed a virtual machine on several PCs and did the same install of an update, settings open, settings closed, and it seems that yes, it is faster to oh, to install updates when your settings are not open. And the uh, exact info from Albacore is here from their uh, from its uh, Twitter uh, page. Uh, so uh, if you want to subscribe, by the way, to Albacore, the uh, Twitter handle is at the book is closed. So basically what he says is that having the Windows Update Settings page open slows down installing updates. It says that there's a process that's responsible for wiring up what's under the hood to the UI that hammers the CPU. And if you have an older machine and you find that it's slow, keeping the settings page open slows down the install process by a lot. So this is very interesting. A lot of people were skeptical about it, but more and more people that are trying it are saying, yep, yeah, it's true. When the settings are closed, it's faster. So next time you have your Windows updates, instead of keeping your settings page open, close it. The updates will be doing whatever they have to do in the background, and um, that will actually accelerate the process of updates because I see a lot of people with updates that take a long time. Remember that when you cross, you know, I mean, I have an old 12-year-old Toshiba here with a magnetic hard drive. When you cross the one hour to an hour and a half time in an update uh, in Windows 10 and 11, it is not normal, even on old machines. So there's a lot of things that can slow down. Of course, antivirus running, if you have a third-party antivirus, that can surely slow it down too. There's a lot of things that um, you know slows down these processes. But next time, try it. Shut down. Once you check your updates, they appear. Shut down the settings app. Just let it be. And things should be faster, apparently. If you enjoy my videos, please subscribe. Give us thumbs up. Thank you for watching.